it's, it's a tool called a rectangular array. It uses technology called beamforming, where we can point the array at a noise source. This has 30 microphones and a camera. And essentially what we get is an acoustic image of that noise source. Uh, very similar to a thermal image where the colors represent the heat. In this case, the colors represent uh, the intensity or how loud the noise source is, uh, superimposed on what you're looking at through the camera. And further to that, not only do we get the amplitudes, but we can also break the DAGDI down into a frequency specter as well. Particularly since with the Windsor Hum, we're interested mostly in the low frequency component of the sound. Well, the, the entire study that's being funded by the federal government is 10 months, but that includes us uh, preparing, doing our initial research, deploying the equipment, gathering data, then analyzing the data, and then assembling our report. So from start to finish, 10 months, uh, we're hoping to hit the ground within the next month, collect data for three or four months, and then we'd analyze and, and submit our report to the federal government.